start by coming in, working out my patients, and then I'll round with the medical team. Um, they're often interdisciplinary, so we have nurses, respiratory therapists, physical therapists, things like that. Um, we'll talk through our patients and round, and then after that it's kind of following up with the teams, making sure orders look okay and everything is appropriate. And usually in the afternoon it's more focused on doing the clinical activities with the pharmacist preceptor, as well as um, doing some teaching opportunities, uh, giving lectures, uh, patient education, things like that. My role as a resident director is really just making sure that we coordinate the program and offer the opportunities that the residents need. So when we're recruiting for residents at our program, we're really focused on communication abilities and leadership styles so that we're making sure that we are really grooming future professionals who are going to go out and represent not only this hospital but the profession of pharmacy very well. Within the residency we have a morbidity and mortality conference um, and the residents are actually the ones that pretty much present that entire series so we do an hour-long lecture over um, something that went on in the hospital and that could be improved and we talked about how we could improve it within our system. Then we also have pharmacotherapy forums that happen every week that um, different pharmacists throughout the hospital come to. You're always learning something new and all of the preceptors we have here are all very passionate about teaching and they're very good about kind of pushing you to go find your own answers. So I think that's been one of my favorite pieces is just realizing that I'm now able to find answers I wouldn't have been able to six, seven months ago and just kind of seeing myself grow and my knowledge has probably been the most fun.